just wanted to have a little conversation today about lighting. You're in my studio right now in Houma, Louisiana. And for years and years and years, um, we have used traditional, traditional type strobe type lighting. And now with today's technology, I've noticed more and more people going to a more uh, LED or continuous light type of light type of lighting. And uh, what, what I'm being lit with right now is a continuous light source. It's upside down, but it's this company right here, LED Geo, and it's versatile. And it's really kind of a neat thing. My, always my issue, with these types of lights, now this is going to get really funky, but my issue has always been with these types of lights that it hurts. When you use LED lights, continuous lights, and you put it on a subject, it hurts. The subject tends to squint and look at you like this. Well, I've noticed with this particular system, what's incredible about it is that, first of all, you can just dial in whatever dimness or lightness you want completely to where you shut it off and you also dial in the warmth so if you want and need a warmer type scene there's no filtering nothing like that you just dial that puppy right in so it's a really really neat system when it comes to that now underneath this little soft panel if you notice there's this rectangular shape and this rectangular shape and so this is actually two panels that go side by side into this little metal um, frame with a, a backing and, a, and a, soft, a soft piece that covers it all up. And I, and I really think it's that soft piece that covers it all up that really makes the difference and not make it so crazy bright. Now, this company makes all sorts of different pieces. Let me put that back in position so it's lighting me up. They make all sorts of pieces. They uh, also make this double piece, which is nice for a strip light. Now, I'm just thinking too, you go on location, more and more of us are doing stuff on location. Can you imagine not having to worry about strobe? Say you have, a, like I had a, a, a job not too long ago in the hospital. Somebody wanted me to go to the hospital and photograph their child, just like a day or two after it was born. Well. You know, can you imagine being able to just walk in with a nice, simple, quiet light source, just like this? It, it would be ideal. And then they also make a single panel, like this panel here. So uh, basically the cost factor, the single panels run around $400. Um, and I highly recommend you give Robert at Dury's a call because Robert helps me out like you cannot believe. And it's, it's so awesome having Robert to be able to, you know, bang ideas off of. And Robert's the one turned me on to this type of lighting. The double panels, whether they're side by side or up and down like this one, those run around 600. It comes with all of the cords and connections and it comes in a nice cool little case. So all of the power packs. Now, I know more and more of us, like I said, are doing things on location where we're not working inside of a studio environment. Okay, so you're out in a field somewhere, you need a little extra light, you don't have 110 volts, no problem. They make a fancy battery that just snaps right onto this device that allows you to dial up the power and change the color and all of that. And you're now running off of battery power. That, you gotta admit, is pretty awesome. Now, another functionality with these things that I'm starting to find out, really, really wicked cool, is this. Let's say your subject, your, your customer, your client, really loves window light, okay? Who doesn't love window light? Everybody loves window light. But the problem on a day, for example, like today, where it's really nasty outside, it's rainy, it's horrible. Hey, guess what? You just simply take one of these panels and you slide it like this, put it right into the window. Just put it in the window. Make sure it plugs back in. And you now have like perfect window light in the window. And like I said, because this unit 
is portable, and because it's the kind of thing that you can run off of a battery, we can literally go put it outside, crank up the power, now you have this beautiful window light where there was no window light before. So just think about that. Used to be back in the day, you know, what we had to do for lighting, we had the big old wonderful, and, and, and there's nothing wrong with it, but we had the big old monster soft box. We had the flash that would go off, the awesome strobes, which I still use all of these types of things. But it's not quite as portable as it once was. The other thing is more and more of us, besides location, more and more of us are doing video projects. Well, let me just tell you, when it comes to video, these lights are incredible. You can set, you have a little conversation, or doing a documentary style video or something like that. You can set one face in the interviewer, one face in the interviewee, and you're like Hollywood, okay? And it's fast, it's easy, it's quick, and it's even battery operated, as has been mentioned. So give Robert a call if you're looking to get into this kind of this new LED phase and let him hook you up with the Versatile, okay? Robert at Dury's. Can't mess it, Dury's.com, and he will take care of you. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the Versatiles, and I hope somebody out there, hope somebody out there has a question. If you do, holler at me, let me know. Thank you for watching, bye.